is Marina milner Balodin, and I'm a science educator here at the University of British Columbia. I would like to show you another experiment that you can easily do at home. The only thing that you need is a glass bottle, and please notice I put plastic, plastic tape about around it, so if it breaks, you never cut your hands. It is always important to keep safe. A bag of marshmallows, and try not to eat all of them before doing the experiment. And I have here an, a small pump that usually people use for wine. You probably noticed that if you have an open bottle of wine, your parents or you usually try to keep it fresh, so you close the bottle and you pump the air out. Let's see what we can do to, with the air pressure here, and the concept is air pressure for this experiment, if we put the marshmallows in. Notice that you have to buy a new bag of marshmallows, and actually the ones that I buy are from Save and Food, which work well. They have to be fresh because marshmallows have a lot of air inside, and they can expand easily. So I put a little, a little bit of marshmallows right here. I can put the bag away. I do not need it anymore. Now I'm going to close the bottle. I'm going to use my pump, and I'm going to do a little work here because I have to work hard to take the air out. I'm going to ask you to focus on the marshmallows when I'm doing that. So let's take the air out. I'm trying to take it out. It is harder than you think. Oh, I'm really tired now. It is difficult, so I took the air out. And I hope you can see that the marshmallows got a little bit bigger. The question is why? And the answer is that the air trapped inside the marshmallows stayed there, creating the pressure inside the marshmallows. On the other hand, the air that was outside, was part of it was removed, so the air pressure outside decreased. And the result, marshmallows increased. What happens if I open the uh, cork here and allow the air in? I hope you formed your idea. And now let's see together what happens. Notice with this experiment, you just need to push a little bit on the wall here, which is making it very easy to let the air in. I'm going to do it, and you're going to watch what happens to the marshmallows. you heard the sound and you noticed how the volume of the marshmallows decreased because the air pressure outside increased and they pushed back on the marshmallows and squashed them. And now you can eat the rest of the marshmallows if you want. Mm -hmm.